Now, Minister, I know that one of the main focuses of your visit this time is to spread the word about Southeast Europe. So how is Greece uh, capitalizing on its uh, strategic position to attract Chinese investors into that region? Well, Southeastern Europe now is the fastest growing uh, region of, of Europe. Uh, most of Southeastern Europe is not part of the European Union uh, yet, although Greece has been a member of the European Union for 25 years already. So we have a lot of experience regarding uh, the European Union and all the countries have aspirations to become members of the European Union. But also we have differences uh, in terms of uh, the education of the labor force, in terms of management experience. We have a very developed banking system compared to the rest of the region. We're heavily investing in the region, so we know what happens in the region. And uh, in this sense, Greece can be uh, the strategic uh, center for, uh, for the growth of Southeastern Europe. Now, it seems that China and Greece are very complementary in many ways in terms of uh, bilateral trade and relationships. So how do you see the uh, partnership going ahead in the future? Well, we have a very good re relationship already. The Prime Minister has uh, visited China recently. We have signed a strategic agreement, which is very, very important. It's a framework agreement to develop our complementary uh, skills and advantages. Mm -hmm. And I think uh, there is a lot of scope now to put the, uh, this agreement into practice. Uh, relations can improve, trade can improve, and we have a lot to offer each other. Of course, taking into account that China is a huge economy compared to Greece, but Greece is a, st is a strategic partner in the sense of being a, a European economy with a lot of uh, European experience in the European Union and a lot of advantages, in, especially in Southeastern Europe. Well, we certainly know that the Western world learned a lot from ancient Greece. Now Greece sharing a little bit of Olympic experience with China. And it's interesting to note that the economy uh, minister is leading a large delegation and he'll also be meeting with China's Commerce Minister Bo Xilai and Finance Minister Jin Renqing. We're heading for a short break. Stay tuned.